Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Promise can I help based on popular demand um, on my previous video I did concerning the spilling oil. People were actually asking me question: How are they making use of this oil? How can it be applied? Can I do a video and tell them how to apply? What to do while using the oil and what not to do and all that? So I got tons of questions from my subscribers. So in today's video, I decided to create a video and tell you and show you how to use this oil because this oil is very strong oil if you are not careful with it it can actually damage your skin so today's video just continue watching i'm going to be telling you how to make use of this oil effectively to prevent any reaction without using it with caution if you don't know how to use it it can cause lots of reaction So, the best way to use this oil, like I said, I've used it before. So, if you have dark knee, dark toe, dark knuckle, dark elbow, dark armpit, dark inner thigh, and if you have any dark spots on, on any part of your body, so I recommend this oil. I have used it before, like I said in my previous video, and it works perfectly for me. Some people say it does not work. So, some people actually um said... Um, the producers actually they said it works for stretch mark like I said in my previous video I have used it on stretch mark. It does not remove any stretch mark Rather what it does it will make the part of the stretch mark to lighten it and make it a little bit lighter Instead of being dark or being red. So basically that is what it does to stretch mark But when it comes to getting rid of dark area this is actually one of the number one products I know I have used and I've seen the effect. So the best way to use this oil, you will apply this oil on your skin, on a clean skin. Some people just make the mistake of applying it on the uh, probably skin that you have gone out from morning to night and all that. On a clean skin, you apply this oil on your clean skin and you will leave it for 20 minutes for the oil to absorb into your skin. After 20 minutes, is it that you rinse it off? If you cannot rinse it off, you just put clothes inside water, uh, squeeze it and use it to wipe off that area. And you are going to use this oil three times in a day, three times in a day. And the same method, the same process that you are actually going to do three times in a day for five days. Hello, if you want results, just do as I'm telling you and you'll see an amazing result. Three times in a day and each of the three times you leave it for 20 minutes on your skin. After the 20 minutes, you rinse it off or you just put cloth and wipe it off. So you use it for five days, five good days. After the fifth day, you will stop the application of this oil and you wait from one to the third day. This oil will start peeling your skin on its own and the peeling is not something that is painful though some people say it's painful it will be painful when you are dragging it just allow it to peel on its own allows mine to peel on its own so i didn't drag it to force it to uh, peel if you are doing that you end up giving yourself wound and blood will start crushing out so i will advise you to from three days after you stop the application of this oil to start peeling on its own so that is just it and then after it peels if you do, do not get the desired results that you want is that part that you're trying to lighten up is not lighting up the way you want it you after the peeling off process is completed you wait for three days for your skin to regain its strength or to heal before you repeat the application of this oil. So it's not just some people you use it once, it peels off everything beautifully, fine. And some people that have hard skin or probably what you are treating or what the dark area is darker than the other person. So you don't expect one time treatment to get rid of that dark area. So you need the reapplication of this oil for you to get an amazing result so you wait three days after the peeling process is completed for your skin to heal before you start reapplication of this oil so that is how you use this oil and the same method the same way you used previously the same way that you use it and you get your amazing results 
And why you are using this scrub, please? Because someone called me and said, ah, is this in pepperish? I use it, it's pepperish shows too much and all that. I asked her, do you do scrub? She said, yes, I use scrub. So, uh, uh, I mean, it's so, <laughs> I don't know what to say. That people buy a product. The description direction is there. People are not reading it. If you read the, when you buy a product, please read what is written there. If you cannot read it, get across to the person that you bought it from. Ask them, how do they use this oil? Make sure that you get a perfect detail. So, I asked her, did you scrub? She said, yes. I said, you don't scrub because I was expecting her to have gone through the instructions and all that. But she didn't do that. So, she just met, she asked me, I said, don't scrub that part. When you are using this oil, please avoid anything scrub. Anything exfoliating and all that. You don't scrub that part. You can just cause skin damage to yourself. So you don't scrub, just use this oil. This oil on its own exfoliates your skin. So you don't need the extra thing that will trigger skin reaction and all that, please. So you don't scrub. Just use your normal soap. And another someone asked me, uh, would I use my cream that I'm using? Like I, what I answered the person, there are some cream that might contain some ingredients or some chemicals that would prevent this oil from peeling your skin effectively. So I will advise, since you are not using it all over your skin, so I will advise that the area that you are making use of this oil, you just avoid your cream on that area. Just bear it for some time, okay? So you can apply your cream on every other part of your body, but the area that you are making use of this oil on, you don't apply cream because I don't know the cream that they are using and there are some ingredients that might prevent this oil from peeling your skin effectively from giving you results. So I just advise that you avoid that area. If you are using it on your elbow, just avoid cream on your elbow for some time. It won't do you anything, okay? Just to make sure that you achieve an amazing result. So the reason why you are using this oil is for you to get an effective result. And another thing, another thing someone asked me, can I use it all over my body? I said no. You know, because I want to sell, I'll tell you, oh, yes, go and use it all over your body and all that. You don't use this oil all over your body. This oil is treatment oil for me. It's treatment oil that is meant to be used on a particular area or part of your body to get rid of a particular issue or that part. Okay, so you're using it all over your body. I mean, how will you feel? You see all your body is peeling and people are asking you questions and all that and you are being exposed to the sun. You can damage your skin. So I don't advise this all over the body. It's treatment or a place should be used on the parts when it's needed. And some people ask me again, should I use it on my face? Yes, it's written there that you can use it on your face. But your face is very delicate. So you should know that, have that in mind. What I usually have five people, though the producer said you can use it on your face, which I know you can use, but you need to pay close attention while using this oil on your face. Make sure it's, you understand that you are exposed. Your face is 100% exposed to the sun directly so you don't have a coverage over your face unlike your skin that you can wear long sleeve and cover it so when you are using if if at all so we advise you to get a product that will work on your face and just avoid using this oil on your face okay so that way you get an amazing and effective result so this oil is very good if you know how to make use of it and don't be disappointed if you are buying it for stretch mark or for scar and all that it does not work like i told you to lighten up that part of the scar and the stretch mark but it will not remove any stretch marks for you so some sellers who have not made use of this oil will come and tell you that oh use it it works on stretch Smart. Oh, use it is very good. Oh, use it is very nice. It will do this. It will do that. It will do that. Meanwhile, they've not made use of this oil to even see if it peels really. So, I mean, I have made use of this oil over and over. So, I can tell you about this oil more than the producers of the oil themselves. Okay. So, this is actually the best way 
for you to use this oil if you want an effective result so that's my honest review about this oil if you have more questions about this oil and all that and please someone actually use it on us uh, kids skin and she told me that oh when the child was taking about it peels off her face I was shouting why should you do that she said because the child has dark spot and she wanted the skin to so please it's not for children please this oil is not for kids it can damage their skin so we should be careful on what we are applying on our children's skin it's not for kids okay so this oil is very good if you are trying to get rid of dark area it's super effective and another thing someone said something someone said that, that someone told her that if you are making use of this peeling oil i don't take your bath for like one week i was like oh my god how can someone go on this without taking your bath for one week for three days and the person have not even used this oil, so that is a lie, it's a big lie. Use this oil, take your normal bath. The only thing, do not scrub the area that you are using this oil on with your scrub or with your sponge, okay? Just avoid that area with your sponge. Take your bath anytime you want to take your bath. There is nothing wrong with this oil. Some people, that, like I said, they don't read the instruction. All what they do, they buy the oil because people are talking about it. It's work. Let me start selling. They've not read the instruction here. When you go through this instruction, the producer actually says, he said, rinse it off. So for you to rinse something off, automatically it means that you can bat while using this oil. So it's a lie. Someone is telling you if you are using peeling oil, you will not take your bath for one week, for three days and all that. It's a lie. I used it. I took my bath. The only thing I just avoid is scrubbing that area with my scrub or with sponge. And it gives me an amazing result. It's even written there. Rinse it off with water. So what would prevent someone from taking bath for one week, for three days? It's a big lie. Please do not pay attention to them. So that is uh, my honest review concerning this oil. So you just get the original of this oil. So far, I have been selling the original of this oil. And another thing, before I forget, uh, thank God I've not forgotten. Another thing, um, it's written there that you need to make use of this oil with lightning cream if you want super effects on your skin. So you need a lightning cream to make use with this oil. And what I normally do for my customer, I have my lightning cream that I produce, I give to them for free. So I advise them that after the whole application of this oil on the part that you need to peel off and you have acquired your desired result, use this cream to blend every area that needs to be blended. So that is my advice and that is what is written there. But the sellers, some sellers will never tell you. All what they are telling you is buy the oil, apply, don't take your bath for three days for one week. God forbid bad thing. And you start smelling all over. Before you know, you develop a warm bacteria that will turn to skin infection and all that. So do not pay attention to them like I said previously. So when you're using it, just look for a nice um, whitening cream that you have. That after the whole application of the oil, after the peeling process and everything, and you just use the whitening cream that you know to smooth it out, okay? And that way you have a permanent result. And when you have cleared off the dark area, when you are applying your cream, please pay attention to those areas. Make sure that you apply your cream effectively on those areas so that you will not have the occurrence of that area because some people after the area has peeled off and they apply cream and they just pay less attention to that so that's my honest review concerning this peeling oil remember cool skin begins with good health do take care of it see you in my next video bless so that's my honest review concerning this peeling oil remember cool skin begins with good health do take care of it see you in my next video bless